guys, I'm Jeff the Homestead Dad, and welcome back to the RV. Um, we are going to be putting in a new seat belt. So the way that this RV is set up is it has one seat belt here, one seat belt here, obviously in the front two seats it has seat belts, and then three on the couch here. That doesn't work out for our family so well. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to add one to each side. They've already got these set up here. Um, so I'm just going to move them. They've got one on one side and one on the other. I'm going to move this so that both are on one side. And then I got these new ones from Amazon. I'm going to put them both on one side. So we'll have two seat belts on either side of the table. And then I'm actually going to, another video, we're going to be adding more seat belts over there. But let's get started with this for now. Let's remove one of these, put it on the other side. Like I said, right now they have one part of the seat belt on this side, the other part of the seat belt on that side. I'm going to go ahead and move this over there and then install the new seat belt here so we have two seat belts, one on each bolt. So all I'm doing is holding the back part of the screw there, taking off the, uh, so there's two nuts on here. One is a lock nut, taking that off and then I take off the standard nut with the washer. And then all I'll do is I'll add back the, uh, the other part of the seat belt and reverse the process. So. Here's the other part of the seat belt. I'll pull this part out, add this back on. Put it back in here, tighten it on, and we're done. So, washer, nut, Lock knot. Tighten it down there nice and good. And just like that, you've got a sweaty homestead dad who's got new seatbelts in. Let me put everything back together and I'll show you what it looks like as a finished product. Just like that, we've got, oops, can you see it? Just like that, we've got two seatbelts, one there and one there. That one, the one that came with the RV is longer. We'll probably use that for like car seats and stuff. This one, will be fine for kids to use, but I'm gonna do that to the other side and that's it. So in 20 minutes, I'm gonna have another project done that will make this RV better suited to our family. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments. I will also put all of the information for the stuff that I used in the links below. Otherwise, God bless you and your family and I'll see you guys in the next video. It's Jeff the Homestead Dad here and we are back in the RV. Um, the way that this RV, oh, that's gonna be terrible. I'm gonna have to turn that off. Thank you.